bring nothing here if I ain't got nothing. Glory be to God anyhow. Yet will I praise him. Cut a long story short. When the, when the devil finished with Job, Job lost everything he had. But God says, I'm a God of the double. <laughs> Somebody give God the praise. Sir. And so what God then he said, listen Job, I can restore you everything you have. And I'm talking to 39 of you. God sent me here this morning to tell you this week is the week of the double. Everything God do for you, he's going to double it up. I wish I had me some praises. I wish I had a praise in check. Back to this. Back to this. Back to this. Back to this. This, 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 this $20 bill is you. This is you. This is Christ and this is God. Now the Bible says my life is it. This is you. In Christ. That's good. My life is hid with in Christ. This is you. You're in Christ. And then it says, with God. So you're in Christ. Christ got you covered. Christ in God. Wow. Amen. Tell me how the devil can get to you. Mm. Woo. Amen. To get to you, he's got to pass through God. Mm. So Christ. And by the time he get to you, he's a sanctified devil. <laughs> In order for him to get to you, God got to give him permission. Yeah. And if God gives him permission, he's got a divine purpose. Tell two person on your road, he's got to get permission to touch me. He's got to get permission. He's got to get permission to touch me. Tell, tell somebody, we wind it up. So he's got to get permission. And if God give him permission, God got a divine purpose. Amen. He set you up. Read the story with Job. Job had at the end more than he ever had before. God give him it. God says, you go there and tell him. I'm going to do it one more time. Watch this now. And so you understand. You understand. Stop worrying about how people see you. At the end of the day, they'll know you've been here. When looking at a prophet in comparison to an army rank and an and order, a prophet would be like the big bomb. They throw the stuff that shut and jar the people just enough to get them to think differently. God is going to use you as his masterpiece. My God. Now the reason, can I tell you why God can use you? Why God can use you? I was talking to somebody the other day and I said, if my sons, spiritual sons and spiritual daughters are not more effective than I am, I have failed as a father. Wow. Hallelujah. They've got to surpass me. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. If they do not surpass me, I would have failed. If Dr. Thompson, who I have consecrated as an apostle, do not surpass me in the apostolic, then I would have failed as a father. And so what God is doing now, he's causing this divine connection because you know they got to surpass me. And I'm going to make it difficult for them to do. And so, and so, because you must have this understanding. You must have this understanding. God does not put yeah. new wine in it's old wine skin. And this is the pouring out of the new wine. Now wine skins must be prepared to receive this. And you cannot receive this. See, you gotta, un you, you gotta understand. Uh, Apostle Thompson's story is not my story. I was never on drugs. I never drank. I never smoked. I never been to a club before in my life. I never danced other than church. I never party other than church. Amen. So there's some people I cannot reach. Amen. Because I cannot relate to their story. And so some of you. God bring you out of the world. And he's saying the reason I bring you, he said, because what I'm doing, see, see, hold the music just a minute. I gotta get this across. Don't let nobody despise you because of where you've been. God left you where you were until he was ready. And he said, time now to get you in. Lord, I feel, I feel, I feel. Saul was always God's choice. Before his name was changed to Paul. He was always God's choice. But he was persecuting the church. Now watch this. He always knew God even though he was destroying the Christians. Read the book of Acts. When God knocked him down, 
how did he know to say who is it love? and different worship and all this kind of thing. And he said, Paul, I need you now to change the name to Paul. i got to send you down to the Gentiles and I can't send anybody to the Gentiles. Amen. My God. Them Gentiles is rough cooking. Amen. <laughs> Them Gentiles, they don't play. I need somebody who is scared. My God. No, like I said, he said, I need somebody who got their story. Yes, See, God can't send you on the street and you don't know nothing but yes, the street. Sir.